up next, a UFC featherweight division fight. Well, this is about as decorated a kickboxer as has come into this division in some time, DC. And if we get a kickboxing match tonight, he ain't losing. He is a championship-level kickboxer, a guy that can stand in the pocket and trade and kick and punch with anyone. He's constantly throwing things. From as close as you can get, he's comfortable throwing leg kicks. He will drive these into your body. But it's the aggressiveness and the ability and willingness to stand in the pocket and trade that makes him truly, truly special. I think that is what separates kickboxing, the high level yeah. level everyone else. He understands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts, Bruce Lee, is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Our tail of the tape now for this featherweight fight. So more than 10 years apart, these two fighters, with some differences in height, but the same reach. To get us started Ladies with the official introduction, Bruce This Buffett. is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 140 pounds. Fighting out of Mumbai, India, Grandmaster. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce. The Dragon League! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room? Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it efficient. like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big-time athletes? Effective punch there by Lee. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Unable to connect with the right hook. What a body kick. Oh, just misses with the kick. Oh, single collar tie here. And now he's got the tie clinch. Big punch from the clinch. Straight right, he misses. 
Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. Big leg kick lands. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Boy, Ty Plum. Nice punch there by Lee. Now, DC, talk to us about that strike. They suck so bad, especially when you're going forward. You walk full speed to a knee to the body, it could in the night. Circling to his right. Great punch. Oh, a combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. And every one of them are landing, overwhelming him with different attacks. Oh, nice job there defensively to block that knee attempt. Good work by Lee. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, how about this kicking game on full display tonight? Kicks back to back and just truly makes up the target. Sight to behold. He's got a serious right punch and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. Just missed on the front kick there. Connection with a punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. Let's get some Let's get going. Big head kick land. Unable to land with that punch. hip into that kick. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. Nice leg kick lands. Oh, head kick. Straight right. Okay, okay, let's focus. Let's focus now. Oh, body kick attempt here. It's no good. Sneaky head kick. Lee's kick attempt. That one was blocked. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. And they separate. Bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to try to change the way that this fight is going.
So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes up. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Oh, he lands a huge kick here. Big punch lands over the top. I was going to call this one. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Single collar tie now. Head kick. Nice straight left hand. Big kick lands. Able to check that kick as well. Three minutes remain in the round. Big ball from Crunch Land. Now we get back to range. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Nice right hand. Big right hook coming, it's blocked. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Oh, he stunned him with that knee to the head. Nice head kick. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Checks the leg kick. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Nice punch by Lee. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Just misses with the left hook. Way to hide that leg kick. Ooh, big shot land. Punch is blocked. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Oh, straight right. in the fight. Yep. <laughs> All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish the fight. Just missed with the left there. All right, we need that takedown. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. And that one was heavy. Oh, big left hook there. How about those five minutes? level striking action in that last round. Daniel, take us through it if you will. Tit for tat. Who has the best chin? It seemed as though they were looking for that answer. Both guys took risk. What a fantastic round. Wow. The striking is on a whole nother level. 
All right, so the next round is underway. Will it be more of the same? And by that, I mean all of those strikes to the body. You've got to think at some point the opposition is going to lower that guard or get finished. And that's exactly what he is hoping for. All those great body shots, all that damage he puts on his opponent will force an opening up. His opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Oh, and there's a land with the kick, so certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good night. Straight right hand counter. Useful. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. Punch over the top. Campbell inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night at that landed. Trying to double up on that jab. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. He just continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Big kick land. Oh, huge block. Well, he's always working off of that jab. Nice jab there by Lee. Real steep body kick. Looks as though his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Beautiful leg kick throw. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Nice. Whiffs on the right hand. Oh, lands another. How's his opponent still stand? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. And you hear the crowd react every time they come together because they understand the power that these guys are striking with. Oh, that's a nice strike. Beautiful head kick. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. Well, not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good to him. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Oh, lands another punch there. Not a mean guy. He's just doing the smart thing. Oh, he has to be attacking that cut, John. I mean, if he's not, then he's doing his opponent a favor. Attack that cut. Make him pay for it. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. Oh, the outside of that lead leg, the left thigh, really showing signs of bruising now. Counter jab, snaps the head back. That'll get his attention. Oh, he lands a huge knee to the body. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the court. He mixed it up. He went high when he was going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. Watch the strike. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Final seconds of round three. 
game of inches right there, oh, boy. Wow. It was a good night at that landing. Oh, All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. And it was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting him over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. All right, so next round underway here, and you got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp, and it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Oh! Looks like he may try to hip escape. All right, working inside the closed guard now. This is no safe place against this opponent. Oh, really nice work to keep busy off of his back as he lands some more offense here for Bob. All right, so he's sort of turtled up here. Not great body language. Perhaps he's trying to bait him in a little bit. Back to the feet now. Nice try. And he landed the right hand there. Look at the torso. He's had a huge strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he lands. Great job. It's such a fast leg kick. at him working at trying to shut the liver down. I'm trying to... Oh! oh! He's Serve him up. Go get him. Oh! He lands, he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kicks. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Straight punch lands. Just over two minutes to go. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Oh, blocks that kick to the body. Nicely done. Connects with the right. Try to establish that jab. I mean, look at the commitment to kick it. Beautiful straight counter. Oh, caught him flush with the head kick there, DC. Beautiful setup to get his leg up there quickly before his opponent could react. Oh, and he caught the kick. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Well, you 
Gotta stay busy on the bottom. He's doing it here. Nice punch. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Oh, oh. Man, as effective as straight punches we've seen all night. Huge straight punch lands, and he's got to hurt very bad. better than he did tonight. A huge knockout under the lights. They'll be talking about that one for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 23 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon! So there he is, the man of the moment, celebrating one of the bigger knockout victories of his career. And got to be nice sometimes with all the hard work that you guys put in when it goes down exactly the way you drew it. A lot of people talk about doing certain things. It's harder to deliver on those promises you make to the public. Tonight, you did exactly that.